In the exam, you will be provided from Red Hat with a control node and some managed hosts. As those virtual machines will run with no graphical interface, you should press Start X on the terminal. I recommend you to press Start X on only the control node and have graphical interface for easier interaction. Then you will have the GUI available, but as the operating system for the examination is hardened, you cannot use a coding text editor like Visual Studio Code. You will have VI and Vim available and you can make your life easier with some, some options that I will show, show you now. I will use VI editor in, or, in order to edit the Vim RC configuration for, to make YAML editing easier. In all the videos on this course, I will use the Vim editor and I suggest you to start practicing with it. So I will go now and show you the exact configuration that I added on the Vim RC file. You can see that the, the line that I added is this one. And I suggest you to make the same before the exam. So you can go and append this line on Vim RC file and then save the file and exit. This, we, this line will instruct about the tab size, the auto identification, expand tab and more. I will show you an example right now. So if I go now and edit with Vim a test.yaml file that I have already created, you can see that we have a bar for identification, numbering on the lines and much more functionalities that you will notice through the course. 